This tractor is a Murray. It has a six-speed shift on the go, also referred to by Murray as also a shift on the fly. And uh, the transaxle itself is a regular old peerless of no difference than one you'd find in any other lawn tractor like a Craftsman or something like that. But with one important exception. When you press the clutch pedal, the clutch brake pedal, down, it disengages tension on the drive belt. But when you also, when you move this stick in, you hear all that noise it makes when you move it? That is actually also releasing tension on the drive belt by moving the same pulley that the clutch brake pedal moves. You can actually see, when you pull this in, see the brake pedal moves down. So the only difference is, when you move this, it does the same thing as pressing that, only since you're not pressing the pedal, it doesn't actuate the uh, large spring for the brake. Let me show you how this works underneath. Here we are under the Murray. There's the engine pulley. There's the drive belt. And that little one pulley down there, that's the clutch uh, idler pulley. Here, Dave, you want to uh, actuate that lever, show how this thing works? Just push that lever in, you want to change gears. Yep, see? Completely releases tension on that belt. Now, um, now press down on the brake pedal. See, it does the same thing with the pulley, but see that big spring right there? Okay, you can let go. That big spring pulls on the brake caliper down there. Anyway, and that's how Murray, when Murray was around, turned a regular manual shift peerless, or a spicer or a foot, transaxle, into a slightly less pain in the ass. Only thing is, while it does release tension on the uh, input pulley on the transaxle, it's, your tractor is still moving, which means all the parts inside are moving, which means that uh, your shift keys are still going to suffer, probably wear out earlier than you would if you had a, uh, you know, right, if you came to a full stop before you shifted your gears. Yep. That's all there is to it. And then you just select the gear you want, and then when you let go of it, it applies the tension again. And your tractor walks away. Broken seat switches are awesome. Back it comes.